Okay, I just took it out of the oven and I want to mention that I checked with the hubs who is like the, um, he's the expert when it comes to custard type desserts like this. And he said, um, honey, I think you need an extra five minutes. So I put it back in the oven for an extra five minutes and look at this. It smells like heaven. It looks wonderful, but folks, you really want to let it cool completely. So I would say give it at least a minimum, oh gosh, I don't know, maybe an hour, maybe, depending on, you know, how long it takes to cool, I guess. I don't know. I would say at least 30 minutes to an hour. Let it cool completely before you cut into it and serve it. Because right now it's still cooking. That's what I read. It is still cooking. It's a custard dessert, which still continues to cook in the heat in the pan. But anyway, um, <laughs> I'm trying not to drink too much of this. Chianti, but it's um, it's so delicious. I keep pouring like I, I'm pouring little glasses, little mini glasses. So I think I'm gonna be okay by the time we get over to our friend's house. Hopefully, I won't be too sleepy. <laughs> Cause you know me, it's no fun when you're sleepy at a dinner party. But anyway, no, I'll be fine. Totally kidding. So let it set. Serve it with Cool Whip or serve it with ice cream. It's gonna be great when you cut into it. And you're going to taste all that wonderful pumpkin pie flavor, but in the crunch itself. And your cake mix has become like your crust. Your crust. So it's delicious. Anyway, cheers. This is my epilogue. Bon appetit. Remember to share your recipes with me. I'm waiting. I want to hear some recipes. Try this, you guys, because it's, it's delish. Have a great weekend.